Hello everyone. So today we are going to properly set up the skill tree as a tab in this uh, post menu. So earlier when I press skill tree, uh, only this skill tree button, only this skill tree appeared, but we didn't move the character into this uh, post stage, this stage with this background. Uh, it was only available for the inventory, but right now no matter what I press uh, inventory button or the skill tree button my character moves into the same stage and shows the menu here and we can switch between these tabs right now menu and map is not implemented yet but later on I will implement that as well right so before we get started let me remind you that here you can watch all the episodes of the series Everything is explained and implemented from scratch. So you can follow these episodes and implement everything by yourself. So feel free to check it out. I'll leave the link to the full playlist in the description below. And also in my Patreon page, you can access project files of this project. And in addition to that, there are thousands of other projects as well. Once you become a member, you can access those projects too. So i'll leave the link to the page in the description below all right now let's get back to the today's episode okay so right now here i have assigned k for the skill tree but when i press the skill tree it's this is what i get but if I switch to inventory, this is what I get. So this is not the way it's supposed to be. I When I press skill tree button, just like when I go to the inventory, my character should be in this view and I should have selected skill trees, skill tree tab. So this is what I want to do now. Okay, so to do that, let me just first open uh, inventory blockchain because this is where I have created the input to switch to the inventory here this one and to input action I inventory so just like this I'll add a new enhanced input input action I a skill tree. Then I'll assign to put map in context. Skill tree. And as the key, I'm gonna assign K. K. So right now. Just for testing purposes, I had assigned K. I just had directly hard coded it here in my player controller. Now I don't want to do it this way anymore. And I want to integrate the open skill tree menu also within this BP inventory blueprint because I want to have the want to move the character to the same background when I open the skill tree as well. Okay so here this let's go here so just like this i'll oh we're gonna need some space here the air skill tree and i'm gonna use this Started and let's do the same thing. So here, instead of calling this enter inventory mode and exit inventory mode, I'll call this post mode because uh, it's now that I am going to use the same background, so the same stage for the skill tree as well. It may not make sense to call it inventory mode, so I'll call it post mode because when we are in the basically when we are in the post mode we move the character to this stage 
So maybe we should rename this blueprint as well instead of PP inventory, something else. But I right now I don't have a suitable name. So I leave it like that. Exit or smart. Okay. And here, this part. uh this here when we enter pause mode this switch to inventory part this is not relevant to the pause mode this should be so i'll move it to over here so control d and delete this Then, when we enter post mode, I'll connect it like this so that entry entry menu will appear here. All right, now let's quickly check if this part is still working. Press I, yeah, inventory is working. Let's I again, we are back. Great, so everything is working, nothing is broken. And this part, let's promote this part to a macro so that I can reuse the same thing here. And what should I call it? So instead of calling this inventory open, let's call it in pose mode. Then let's collapse to a macro. Let's call it toggle pause mod. The reason that I converted this into a macro instead of a function is because only if we are entering the pause mode, the execution will continue here. So we can use that to switch to whatever the uh, menu that we need to switch. So I'll do the same thing here. Duplicate, connect. And now here, switch to skill tree. Switch to skill pen. Let's call it like this. Now, that's it. Press K. See, now we are in the uh, skill tree menu directly, but the character is already in the background, so that's exactly what I wanted. And from here, we can switch to uh, inventory mode as well if needed. And if I press K again, I'm back in the level. So, of course, these skill activation things are already working, we have already tested that because here right now I don't have any skill points required to activate any of the new skills but it's working we already know that okay so now let me go back to the player front and let's uh, clean this part up I don't need this anymore add a comment okay. okay so what should we rename should we rename this pp inventory mod inventory maybe let's call this pp boss stage All right so thanks for watching as always updated project files will be available for download in the patron page link would be in the description below and let me know if you have any questions in the comments see you in another episode goodbye